Right, we are unboxing or sort of unboxing an HP 240 Bluetooth mouse. This is a red one, but they do come in various colours, I think black and silver. I've used on my laptop, my Spectre, HP Spectre laptop, which is here, you can't see it's out of the picture. I usually use an HP mouse that comes with a Spectre mouse, but I've had a little bit of trouble with it sticking and jamming and the battery's going flat and it doesn't show the battery condition so I thought a bit more reliable I'd try something new so I've now got a HP 240 Bluetooth mouse which is actually cheaper it comes with a AA battery and a, some, in, some information leaflets which I don't bother to look at there, so there's the mouse to put the but now this might confuse you. It doesn't come apart. To put the batteries in, you actually you actually take the sort of top off like this. Put your nail. It's a little little edge slit there. So you take that. So they you take that off if I can. And stick an AA battery in. Then you just put this back. Try to put it back. Yeah, it just slips back. On off switch. And it actually shows on the Bluetooth and devices, this is on Windows 11, actually shows you pair it easily. It comes up as HP 240's Bluetooth mouse. You pair it and you connect it. Just the usual way by making the, making the um, computer visible to pair with Bluetooth. And it actually shows 100%. It actually shows the level of the battery. And I've never had any trouble with this. It's very, very, I got it from Amazon. It's very, very sort of cheap, cheap. And it's smaller, smaller than my other one. Smaller than the other one. And I can put my hands around it quite easily. So I just thought I'd share that with you. So there we are. Is the, the HP Bluetooth mouse 240. And it's Bluetooth. When you buy mice, quite often they're wireless. You have to have a wireless dongle like Logitech ones, they're wireless. If you want a Bluetooth because you've got Bluetooth already incorporated in your app, do check that it's actually Bluetooth. A lot of, if you do a scan Bluetooth mouse, mice, quite often they'll be wireless ones, which is different frequency, it's not the same. So make sure if you want a Bluetooth mouse, make sure you've actually looked and it's Bluetooth in the spec and not Wi-Fi.